Keeping blood sugar within a narrow range is critical to avoid the long-term complications of diabetes. For years, that meant finger sticks to check blood sugar a dozen or more times a day. You got to pull out a whole bunch of stuff, check your blood sugar, and the finger sticks hurt. They hurt more than injections, you know, for people. Even worse than the pain and inconvenience is that finger sticks only give a snapshot of blood sugar at that instant in time. I had no idea if it was going up or down or was it staying stable. Lance Bergstein is a serious amateur race car driver who knows that high blood sugar means long-term complications, but low blood sugar on the track could be lethal because of impaired brain function. That's where continuous glucose monitors, or CGMs, come in. The newest version, called the Dexcom G6, is a quantum leap in CGM technology. It's a tiny needle that stays under your skin for up to 10 days, sending signals about your blood sugar. It's made a huge difference, both in reduction of high blood sugars and a reduction in low blood sugars. These devices have really been life-changing for people. Dr. Carol Levy, director of the Mount Sinai Diabetes Center, says the G6 CGM is a major advance because it constantly uploads blood sugar readings to your smartphone. And from there to anyone you decide should know your levels. Also important is the ability to set alarms for too high or low blood sugars. It's the loss of fear of going to sleep at night, worrying whether your blood sugar will be too high or too low. You're get, going to get an alarm. You don't have to wake up. Another major plus is the applicator that attaches the G6. The insertion of it is uh, a night and day difference. They came out with, you know, a one button applicator that is completely painless um, and there's no calibration involved. And that calibration issue is big. It's the first CGM that the FDA does not require calibration with finger sticks. There's another new CGM called the Libre, but you have to wave a wand over it to get the readings instead of automatic uploads to your phone and you can't set high low alarms with it. So this Basically, you change it every 10 days or so, move it to a different spot, mm -hmm. usually on, on your abdomen, and it translates into a much tighter control of your blood sugar, keeping it from getting too high, too low, and it means long-term fewer complications.